Whoa, 250. That is a rare find. They're somewhat of a collector's item, but again, I just would happy be happy for them to walk away. Yeah, watch out for that guy. He's an e-bear. Oh, is that right? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Morning. I buy your catcher's gear. Would you throw in the glove, Carson? Yeah. Would you throw in the glove if he buys your? Yeah. Cup? Okay. Cool. I'll keep. Uh, yeah. I'll keep looking around. I'll set that right here if that's okay. Does that have this for a buck? Oh, okay. There you go. Yep. Thank, Thank you. you. Good luck to you. You too. <clears throat> Most people have bought like all of the videos and stuff already. Oh yeah, but those went quick. Yeah, they went first things. Good luck with your sale, thanks. No, thank you. Morning. Good morning. Do you have any guitars or just the amp? Just the amp. Just the amp. Got detailed tags and everything. Yeah. My husband lost a lot of weight and everything's too big for him now. Oh really? Yeah. Whoa, 250. That is a rare find. That's Winston Cup, NASCAR. Um, back in the day. Was he a truck driver for Miller? My son was, yes. Oh, that's cool. Good luck with your sale. Thank you. Morning. Morning, how are you? I'm doing great. How about yourself? Good. You a coke dealer, uh, collector? No, I'm a reseller. I sell on eBay. Oh, do I'm you? always looking for things to flip. Yep. Yeah. Oh. And we had a girl on here earlier said she was a picker. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of us floating around. Just have a gr community garage sale and all the pickers will come out of the woodwork. Pizzazz Plus. Pizza. I'll give you 10 bucks for it. Okay. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Morning. Oh, 
asking for your chair. Five bucks? I'll take it. It sure is. Uh, Legs are size, huh? Yeah. What are you asking on this? Five, Five bucks? Switch is on the side there. Interesting. Link X011. Yeah, I'll take that and the uh, chair, so I'll get 10. Okay. Appreciate you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Good luck with your sale. Yeah, you bet. That chair is beautiful. Yeah, that's an old one. Yep. It's got the maker back here, too, it looks like. Sykes? S I K E S? What are you asking on that? I was going to ask 20, but you make me a good offer, I'll tell Sykes Buffalo. I'll give you 20 bucks for it. Okay. There you go. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Good luck to you. If you're okay, I might just pull up and try to load instead of lugging it all out in the street. Morning. Okay. Yeah. How's it going, man? What's your name? Here in Vandalia, Jerry. Jerry, nice to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you. Yeah, I saw the citywide sales. Like, I'm gonna make the drive yeah. up for that. Yeah, I've been yeah. hitting all around here. You been finding stuff? Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's a good day for it. Yeah, it's you nice. know that. You ever seen Flippin' Junk Wick? Flippin' Junk Wick. I think so. Yeah, I've heard yeah, of that channel. Up here. Okay. He, he, I, I bump into him all the time. Oh, nice. He, he's been pretty good too. That's great. Never, I, first time I ever bumped into you. Yeah. Small out. world. Yeah. yeah. Well, good luck. I've been watching your videos. I appreciate it. Hey, good luck to you too, Jerry. Yeah, you too. Yeah. I mean, he. I have no complaints. <laughs> Here you go for your uh, batteries. Okay. Good luck with yourself. Thank you. Thanks. Morning. Light bulbs with that too. Cause no it kidding. Works off light bulbs and she even put light bulbs in there. Whoever whoever buys that probably wants the light bulbs. I'm like, okay. <laughs> wow, that is cool. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty old. I think it's from like the sixties and stuff. So. Is it from your child? You had it as a kid? My my sister did. Your sister did, yeah. Kind of, uh, me and my sister got it. <laughs> hmm. So yeah. Is any of this stuff back here for sale? No, okay. I should probably cover that up with no, that right. too. <laughs> I tried to make it yeah, somewhat clear, but yeah, I don't know. <laughs> and we think that that is still a good working ca camera. My daddy used that a lot before um, he passed away, and now, you know, we all have our cell phones and stuff. So right. You know how it's, uh, it's kind of different now. How much are your uh, bookends? Oh, make me an offer. I don't know. 
I looked them up, looked them up online, and they're somewhat of a collector's item. But again, I just would happy be happy for them to walk away. <laughs> Did you do five bucks? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Thank that. you. Yeah, watch out for that guy. He's the e bear. Oh, is that right? <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> go for it. You got the GoPro? Are you the Commonwealth picker? No, no, I'm Cincinnati picker. <laughs> Commonwealth down in Virginia. <laughs> Well, and you know what? You might be able to get more than five bucks for them on eBay, so go for it. <laughs> oh, you definitely will. It, I've, I've had this for so long, I'm just ready to say bye-bye. Yeah. Send them on to the next person. So, I don't know. You get like that when you get old. Sure, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. So, do you do a full-time man? Yeah, yeah, I do. That's awesome. Yeah, that's fun. I'm going to take your doll, too, so I owe you 35 Alrighty, well, thank you. There you go. Got changed. I that? got exact, yeah. Oh, that's so perfect. Thank you so much. Thank you. Good luck with the sale. Do you watch Commonwealth? Uh, sometimes I do. do yeah. yeah. Kevin's a nice guy. How are you doing? I'm great. He actually uh, came here last year when we had the reseller rally. Oh, did he? Yeah. I just started doing this stuff in like January. So oh, that's fun. That, yeah, it is fun. Have Thanks a great day. Thank you. It was nice meeting you. Good luck, buddy. Too. Good luck to you. Thank you so much. Back at the house, I thought I'd show you guys these two chairs before I put them in the garage. This folding chair here, these things are super collectible, but I have a hard time moving them on eBay just because the size of them and the dimensions and everything. Usually the shipping price that people get are really high. So I'm probably just gonna try to flip this local. And then this right here is just a really cool piece. This is the uh, Sykes Company, S-I-K-E-S, -E out of Buffalo. And it needs a little love, but overall the bones are in really good shape. I wish it wasn't an office chair. If it was just like a regular chair, it'd probably be an easy seller, but I still think I can get 50 to hundred dollars for it. Uh, I'm gonna try to sell it local. Okay, here's the rest of what I found today. I got this uh, vintage Mattel dance arena doll in the box, and these things are going around 150 to 200 dollars. Now it's supposed to move left and right. I'm sure it's got batteries in there. I don't know if it works. I'm, I'm sure that'll definitely affect the value whether or not it works, but for 25 bucks, I was all over that. She also had an Easy Bake Oven, original from the 60s with the original box, and she only wanted 25. And I, when I looked them up, I would have expected them to go for a lot more. There was one or two that maybe went for like 100 to 200, but the vast majority of them like 40 or 50 bucks. So I left that there. Got this Olympus Stylus Zoom 115 camera for five bucks. These are going for $100, believe it or not. I keep telling you guys, keep an eye out for these little point and shoots. They're coming back in a big way. Got this little Honda Fat Cat Koozie for a dollar. This same one sold for 40 bucks. Got this Presto Pizzazz Plus for 10. This is the kind of stuff, if you are serious about reselling and making money, you'll be able to find because most people will look at this and they're like, I don't wanna mess with that, I don't wanna ship it. Yes, it's a little bit more work, but these are regularly selling for 40 to $50. So if you're willing to put in a little bit of extra time, there's money to be made with stuff like this. Got this vintage Ohio State um, basketball hoop for three. I'll probably sell that local, a little too big to ship, I think. Got an Eddie Bauer jacket for two. Um, that's my dad's size. I might just give that to him. I don't know. Or sell it. I don't know. If he wants it, it's his. If not, I'll sell it. This uh, leg exercise machine, I was really shocked when I looked this up. Very high sell-through rate and it sold for about $80. I only paid five for that. I got these pet safe batteries because they are um, OEM, uh, you know, genuine pet safe brand. I think only one of the packs is still sealed and uh, it's really only going for like ten dollars free shipping so not really a great buy she did have the um the enclosure thing like that system that keeps the pet in but didn't have the power cord otherwise that would have been a good buy and just a word of the wise anytime you're selling um this pet related stuff you can't use the word pet safe unless it is a pet safe brand and you can't use invisible fence unless it is the invisible fence brand because otherwise you're going to get hit with vero on uh, ebay got these vintage pegasus bookends uh, by the sneed company for five bucks those are selling for 35 i thought this pulley was vintage when i picked it up but it is definitely like a modern new production still cool for five bucks i think i can get 20 for it somebody will use this de as decoration last few things um i got this hat at a sale and my camera died right as i was buying it i paid two dollars for it uh, it's an old honda dealer just has a really cool graphic it's got a patch um hats are hats have been really saturated the market is so saturated so i don't know what i'll get for this i'm hoping 20 30 bucks 
I got all this catcher's gear for 20 and they threw in this Mizuno glove. Um, this is probably a $20 glove. Um, but yeah, it's got the uh, knee pads, chest protector, helmet, so the knee savers. I think it's basically everything but a glove, but a catcher's glove. So I should do really good with that. I bought some Under Armour catcher's gear maybe a month ago, and it sold like two days after I listed it for $50 plus shipping. So I'm hoping to get the same for this. And lastly, I got this Healthometer Pro Relief Shiatsu. Not a very good sell-through rate. I only paid three for it, and I'm hoping to get like 25 to 30. Keep an eye out for these massagers, these bigger ones that kind of oscillate. They can bring some really good money, some of the bigger ones. That's it for this video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.